Yeah, like, so, you know, no, 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 keep that where it's at. But be, Following the lead of Father Mike DiMartinez, the cast is always thinking outside of the box. I had to pick shows that I knew I could distance safely and wouldn't take away from the play. Like, we don't have any, like, kissing scenes or, you know. But are you good enough for it? That's, I'm afraid I am not. We modernized the show. And even the fight scenes, we, we had to, like, make it so that there was no contact at all. This is back in the fall, and everything was really strict. The fight scenes were almost two guys avoiding each other and one then kind of hitting into the wall and getting knocked out. And she's, you see how she's upright? Mm -hmm. like the pandemic presented a number of stage challenges, but the students adjusted and embraced the opportunity. How excited are you to be on stage again? <laughs> Very. Um, theater is kind of like my everything. I'm going to college for it. So um, I've been in place since freshman year. So it's very exciting to be able to do this in such hard times. It's been longer hours sometimes just because we have to then take into account schoolwork, which has also been different with remote learning and stuff like that. So it's kind of just been a process to get used to. One of the biggest challenges I felt we all faced was that it was hard to get into character, not being able to touch anyone. We had to, I guess, adapt, and the way I felt most people adapt was they they started embodying their characters more, and they started, I guess, using more, more and more into the characters themselves. So instead of having to rely on other people to get into the characters, they relied on themselves, and really, I guess, found inspiration and motivation from themselves, which is a big difference.